We would like to introduce you to Ted, the Tango Wir zeigen Ihnen nun den Aufbau des elektronischen Tangos Ted, seine Funktionen und die Montage am Tango Beam. The setup of Ted is identical to the manual Tango with the addition of the integrated gear racks. Center mount the 1.2 meter length of track on a tripod and mount the enclosed monopods on each end, putting a little pressure between the track and the ground. If using the 1 meter length to extend your track, you will have to support the end with either a camera tripod, a lighting stand, or one of our slider stands. See that the motor is slightly angled when you place Ted on the track and the power unit should be on the gear rack side. It'll be slightly angled when sliding it on. When attaching the end stops, the sensor should be inserted into the track on the side of the gear racks. Move the unit towards the center, open the orange clutch and move the motor to engage with the gear rack. Connect the dyna stick using the cable provided, mount the battery and switch on the dyna stick with the silver switch. The switch has three positions, off is to the left, the middle position is run mode and the right is the programming mode. By moving the rocker switch backward and forward, you run the TED Tango up and down the track. The electronic end switches switch off the drive unit automatically before the end, so there is no possibility of hitting the physical end stops. One of the first things to do is set your desired electronic end stops. Shift the, shift the switch into the programming mode, move the dolly to your first end stop and press the dial at 12 o'clock. An arrow underneath ES is in your display indicating the set end stop. You can then move to your second end stop and press 12 again. If you press the center dial while programming, you will come to the settings of the ramps, JS. If this is on 20, it will start and end the move the quickest. Pressing the arrows left and right, 9 and 3, change the ramp setting where 1 would be the slowest. If we change the arrows top and bottom, 12 and 6, you can change the speed at which Ted approaches the end stops. Pressing the center of the dial again, you will arrive at the position programming. First you go to the starting position and press the top, 12 o'clock. Save the position is shortly indicated in the display. Now you can store a further three positions at 3, 6 and 9 o'clock. Change the run mode and press the stored positions. Only in the run mode you can start the looping. Therefore press the center of the dial and you will shortly see the available functions. MEM is the memory uh, of the four positions you are able to program. Loop indicates how often the move will be repeated and delay indicates how many seconds, minutes the unit will stay at each position. Pressing 3 will start the loop mode. In our setup, Ted goes back and forth between two positions and stays in each position for two seconds. Pressing at the center again will stop the loop program. Another function is the speed of the unit, which is chosen in the programming mode by turning the dial. 
If you go from 9 to 1, the slowest moves can be achieved. And if you go from positive to negative numbers, you can change the direction of the head. You can change the percentage of each of the speed settings with the potential meter at the side and change the speed in either the run or programming mode. The foot pedals can also be used by switching the dynastic to the external 